Shalom. Happy Sabbath. Our Grow devotional on this Sabbath is entitled The World's Greatest Need. According to you, brothers and sisters, what is the world's greatest need? Is it wealth, power, spouse, or other things? Let us listen to today's devotional. There is an interesting verse for us to look at, which is found in the book of Isaiah, chapter 5, verse 20. Here is what it says, Vu unto them that call evil good, and good evil, that put darkness for light, and light for darkness, that put bitter for sweet, and sweet for bitter. The biggest problem that threatens humans is not an economic crisis, financial problem, or a severe natural disaster. But the most dangerous thing is when people experience moral degradation and eventually become morally dull. Why? Because at times like that, mistakes and sins become unclear. And people will find it difficult to say and distinguish between right and wrong, good and bad, and even easily twist them. Under these conditions, what is the world's greatest need? In the book Education, page 57, it is said that the greatest one of the world is the one of men. Men who will not be bought or sold, men who in their inmost souls are true and honest, men who do not fear to call sin by its right name, men whose conscience is as true to today as the needle to the pole, men who will stand for the right though the heavens fall. Human types who are not treated in this world are only a few, and it can be said one of a kind. Look at the failure of Balaam and Judas, the two money paid men whose lives ended tragically, but learn from Daniel, Hananiah, Mishael, and Azariah, who did not worry about the risk and stress of death. They kept the faith and righteous principles, and God ultimately protected and blessed them. How about us? Are we willing to be those who cannot be bought and sold? If so, let us pray for His guidance and power to change our character to be in accordance with His. May the meditation on this blessed Sabbath remind us to be the people who are needed by the world today, namely individuals who cannot be bought and sold by wealth, power, spouses, and others. Let us stand firm in righteousness even though the heavens fall. May the blessings of the Sabbath be a part of all of us. Amen.